really freedom. Freedom over space, freedom over speech. Freedom. I love you, Scotland. This is brave. I'm brave, but it's really hard. Right guys and hi everyone this is me Racing Wolf and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh guys today at least I can relax. The weather is so amazing, I'm so happy. I'm already traveling three days and the weather is just brilliant and this viewing area at this venue is such amazing, such beautiful place and actually the venue which I'm visiting is Smart Car Raceway Elgin and you know what I'm still gonna chill a little bit up here and uh, you guys I'm gonna take you straight away for a few warm-up laps Okay guys, and here we are, we on board at Elgin Circuit, we is there, uh, very very old sodies, which used to be Daytona Sandown Park sodies, and I think these go -karts, I even filmed them during my death testing at uh, Sandown Park, I think this is still was that chassis, that old old chassis, I mean, it's yes it's old but around this circuit it's it's okay it's it's really fine no problems right guys um okay uh go karts not new but that's fine but the venue look at the venue look how quick it is even now warming up the tires i'm still warming up the tires but look at the speed i think <laughs> honestly on a cold truck on a cold engine with the cold tires the speed is cool and this truck only I think it's a 350 meters maybe up to 400 but I can guarantee you it's not more than 400 meters and let me quickly tell you about racing line here we go start finish the first right hander very small full throttle second right hander full throttle as well very small now we have the chicane le right left and right but the big right because now it's coming into the right hairpin after short straight and straight away left hander now we can relax a little bit but not for long because we are approaching the left hairpin but it's easy to take hairpins you need you use all the truck available uh, with the apex and the same we have a right hander but right hander is tricky because you're staying more inside like in the middle and now we have a left and right and again start finish so you see the circuit is really short uh, but you know what um i'm still i'm still shocked how quick it is especially this corner where i'm now I mean, it's seriously quick, guys. Seriously quick. Even this hairpin, the slowest, the slowest corner on this circuit, uh, but it's uh, it's quick enough. I'll be honest with you, it's quick enough. As you could see, you just look on the left. The, there is a bird which joined me on the track, <laughs> so I don't feel so lonely over there. Uh, you, you're gonna see it a bit later, guys. Now, guys, be careful, cause pit lane is just starting up here, so be careful when you're walking. And actually, I wanna tell you, take you all the way down to reception. Oh my God, all this you've done months. by yourself? Yeah. Wow, that's a cool idea. This is all literally just not this. It's not totally finished yet. There's still bits to go to the bottom, but um, the shell there, so and the spark plugs, they, that went up yesterday. 
That is so old. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's nice. So, so then you've got the Shell and then the Ferrari. The Ferrari goes hand in hand with Shell, so. Wow. Wow. She was well, so the podium was all graffiti. Oh, it man. was Rab, Rab graffiti in the back of art that did that. That looks so cool, I love it. It's more called Raceway. It looks like Abu Dhabi. <laughs> <laughs> it's Bahrain. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's it's a. Uh, That's why it reminds me something it's a, Arabic. <laughs> it's a concept art of like the main street of Bahrain, but it's the uh, it's the wrong way. Can I see your? Yeah, that was put in. That was just put Ooh, in. Nice racing well. shoes. Nice racing wetsuits as well. So these are these are the kids' ones. These are the adult suits, and then the the rain suits start from here. Rain and go back. We've also got the for the smaller kids as well. Um, and then when it gets cold, we've got the thermal. Brilliant. The thermal suits. What is your name, sir? My name's Andrew. I'm ah, sorry, Racing Wolf. <laughs> nice to meet you. Okay, I'm going to take my viewers to the truck, back to the truck. Yeah, right. Okay guys, and we're back on a truck and this is uh, another part of my session. I've done two sessions, each of them 15 minutes. I'll be honest with you, if not this bird on the left, I would feel really lonely on the circuit. Uh, you know, I'll be honest with you, if I would be driver beginner and I need a practice session, this venue is really suitable um, and I'll give you a few reasons why. Um, the first reason, it's short. So it's re really easy to remember short venues uh, because the, this circuit, actually this circuit has one, two, three, four, and now we have a five, six, and seven. Then the hairpin, which is just in front of us, is the eight, nine. It actually has a ten corners for such a short truck, but it's easy to remember them, honestly, because Mm, I calculate, uh, I'm, I'm counting the complex corner as a one corner, for example this one, left and right hander, I'm, take, I'm counting it as a one corner, I mean even if it's a left and right hander, you know, uh, but yeah, this is the reason number one, because it's short, reason number two, uh, easy to remember the corners, um, of course, reason number two comes from reason number one, so reason number three, uh, exactly on this venue the corners are quick complex but at the same time they not that complicated they really simple to understand them because there is a complicated corners for example if you take wilton mill uh if you take uh pfi or, or rye house especially rye house uh, there is a lot of complicated corners which is good really good uh, but for drivers beginners this venue short easy rem memorable and with the uh, simple corners uh, it's uh, the best to start i'll be honest with you so here we go uh, three reasons i gave you um, reason number four can be that bird on the track <laughs> you're not gonna feel lonely because i spoke to the owner of the venue and he said that bird is always always coming with the cards driving around even if it's a five six drivers that bird is very often coming there okay guys um yeah I'm sorry for <laughs> uh, speaking about birds, not about racing, but uh, as you can see, again, look, look at this speed, look around this corner, look how quick it is. Yes, I use the brakes, of course, because it's impossible to go flat out there. Even look at this hairpin, it's really quick, really quick. And you know what is the craziest thing? These go karts, it's a 200cc engines, just 200cc. These chassis, when they used to be at Daytona, uh, they used 390cc engines up there. And uh, f around Soundon Park, it was quick. But around this venue, with the 200cc, look at the speed, guys. It's really quick. It's more than enough. And um, I was a bit scared in that corner, uh, which I just now passed, because th the brakes, um, I, c I couldn't feel the brakes. The car is so light. So, so I really couldn't feel the brakes. I mean, with the heavy engines, the car brakes better. With the lighter engines, the car brakes uh, worse because less um, less weight on a go kart. Okay, guys. So you know what? I'm gonna leave you for one more lap, uh, just on your own with a pure karting sound.
to be honest with you, for the venue, uh, for 500 meters, 450, it's, this engine is more than enough. Uh, practice your skills is more than enough. Uh, handling, uh, the same like the Toronto karting handling, <laughs> old, old karting. Uh, you need to fight in the corners, but listen, you are a racing driver, you have to deal with it. So, it's a, it's a, it's a cool car, really cool car. Uh, what is the best lap? So the best lap, 32.8, is, ah. is the customer, customer <laughs> track record. One of the staff members uh, has done it faster. Wow. 32.2, but that was with a clear track and no one else on it. Well, I was no one there. <laughs> and the guy, the guy that did the the record thirty two point eight, he was a rally driver. Okay. So well, I'm anyway better. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Everything done, and I can again relax in this area for a few more minutes, and then I will head all the way up to northeast. Uh, I mean, it's like middle of the Scotland, not all the way north of Scotland. No, no, it's more to the east. Uh, film uh, something else you will find out it's in uh, not in the next video okay guys uh, thanks a lot for watching if you like this video hit the like button don't forget uh, share comment uh, actually comment uh, what you think about the small circles like 500 meters it's I think it was really interesting it was really interesting and um, did I say share yeah I think I did did I say subscribe I think I did uh, share subscribe and um, Guys, uh, as usually, I'll see you in the next video. See ya!